at. Don't let the storms of life, you know, dictate what's going to happen. Know that if God has spoken it to you, you is faithful to fulfill it. So he told the disciples, let us go over to the other side. So leaving the crowd behind, they took him along, just as he was in the boat. There were also other boats with him. So a furious quail came up and the waves broke over the boat so that it was nearly swamped. Jesus was in the stern, sleeping on a cushion. So he was at the back and he was having a nap. So the disciples woke him and said to him, Teacher, don't you care if we drown? He got up, rebuked the wind and set the waves. Quiet, be still. Some other translation say, peace, be still. Then the wind, the wind died down and it was completely calm. He said to his disciples, Why are you so afraid? Do you still have no faith? They were terrified and asked each other, Who is this? Even the wind and the storms, even the wind and waves obey him. So Jesus Christ is speaking into your situation today. He says, peace be still. Whatever is terrifying you, whatever is causing you to be afraid, Jesus Christ is saying, peace be still. He's speaking peace into your situation. He's speaking peace into your circumstance. He's calming the sea on your behalf. You might think he's not there, but he is always there. And he will show up for you. Regardless of the time, regardless of the situation, he will show up for you that circumstance.